you into my life or whatever. Forever, feeling like you could do better, better than me. I'm wishing OT, wishing you stay. Hey guys, what is going on today? Welcome back to a brand new video, guys. I want to say if you watched yesterday's video, if not, go and check it out. It's how to trade with 1 to 5k. I wanted to show you here after the, these that we did actually sell on the Matic for 1.1k, the Joe Gamer for 1k. We sold this Femina, who was a right wing back, for 3.5k. I showed you that would work, and that was nothing relevant. So we made about 3.5k off yesterday's video. We only started like with 5k, it was pretty much as the example. So we're going to show you today the top 5 players to snipe. Obviously, the first one here is going to be Vincent Jr. Vincius Jr. He goes for around 5.6k so we'll say 5.5 just to be safe and make sure that he definitely sells here so we're going to try and snap him here for 5k we drop it down to 5k and then we're going to pretty much sit like this on the market and try and pick anything up that comes up and hopefully we will see a deal in this video it's only 8.40 at night so there should be some deals popping up we're going to show you five players today this is going to be the first one make sure you check out yesterday's videos there was two up guys one was a pack opening the first time one on FIFA 18 and the only one that I'm ever going to probably do until team of the year so make sure you check that out we got some pretty good inform pulls and then the second video was a trading method, which obviously if you're watching this one, you're clearly interested in trading. So hopefully you'll be able to find some more. But we see here, Vincis Jr. not really doing anything good tonight, which isn't very good. I mean, you saw my transfer list. I had one that I sold on for profit. So that's a little bit frustrating. I only left him in there for proof that they sold. But I was hoping to at least find one tonight, which is a little bit upsetting that none are coming up. We'll give it another like 10 20 seconds. If not, we'll move on to the next one. I'll make sure I definitely see one of or some other players. I mean, obviously, sniping right now isn't the easiest thing in the world because so many people are doing it. But you see here at 5.6k, look, there's a couple up. There's a left mid one there. You could ideally pick that one up and sell it on. I mean, I'm just going to check the market really quickly for left mid just in case I do happen to need to pick that one up. And here, 6.6k, it was a right good deal. Look, I mean, that there, if you know the market, you know you can pick up any left mid ones there for that price. So that's pretty frustrating there. So we're going to just have one more search in here at 5k. And maybe it's up to about 800 and then we'll just move on to the next player. Which I will show you in a second guys. So here we go. Like last couple of searches. One, two, two, one. Right, last search. There we go. Right, so we're going to go into a Dama Traore now guys. These are players that obviously a lot of people will snipe the first three I think. And then after that I have a few uh, rare ones for you that not many people will do. I can't actually remember his price. Yeah, he's about 7k I think. Yeah, 7 not 8.2, I was going to say, I'm sure I see him on for less earlier, um, yeah, okay, look, wow, he's dropped even more, actually, he was about 9k at one point when I first started sniping, he has started to drop a little bit, but 6.5k is a solid price for him, so that means you can now obviously start searching the market, you can sit like this, obviously, and press X and B on the market, if you don't want to keep going in and out the other way, but it's a little bit harder to get them, I think, this way, you can obviously also bid on them, but I wouldn't recommend bidding because <laughs> the chances of winning them are really difficult. So we'll go 5.9k, then we do is just search like this. These are just popular players, guys. Like even this like this video now is going to be more relevant when the full game comes out because obviously more people have the game, more people will be opening packs, more people will be buying players, selling teams, etc. So right now, obviously, people's 10 hours are going to be running out and whatever, so there's not going to be many people opening packs, maybe stuff like that. It's sometimes a little bit difficult at the start to make these good snacks. But these snacks are going to apply for at least the first couple of weeks, so if you don't get anything in the first couple of days doing this, just keep trying, you will get deals. So, yeah, hopefully, we'll find a deal here on the Dama I mean, the market's been a little bit rubbish tonight. Um, it's frustrating me to be fair. I can't believe nothing's coming. I mean, they're actually selling on for 6.5 now, so we'll go to 6.6. Now you see there's three more up at 6.6. Um, but yeah, you just want to keep searching. I mean, 6.4 there is not a deal. 3.7 though, look at that. Boom. There we go. You can sell that on for 6.5k. That is how you do it, guys. So yeah, pretty much we're now going to go list him up. I'm going to transfer it 6.5k. That just proves that how sick the sniper is. 2k profit on one card there. Just like that. I mean, 6.2 is not exactly a bad price if you're going for like a 6.7 sell on overnight. So they, they would sell on. The next one is going to be if you have a little bit more coins now. This is going to be, I'm always going to drop down to another cheap player in a minute. But we're going to do Jesse Lingard now. He's going for around between 9 and 11k now. He just keeps switching around. I think they should drop back down again to like 9. <laughs> it's nice. It actually might be exactly 10. And then 9.9. .9. Is the cheapest one, so maybe 10k is the average selling price here. Um, yeah, we'll sell for 9.9 because obviously there's quite a lot. So that means 500 coin tax, 9.4. So we ideally want to be sniping them at 9k here. So we'll get down to 9k and we're going to just sit here and buy anything that comes up for 9k or less. I mean, I don't really expect to see a Lingard very often, but there you go. 3k for Jesse Lingard. I mean, that's a 6k profit here to pick that up there. I mean, this just sums up how good these players are to snipe. Like, 
they don't come up all the time, but you know when they do come up, it's going to be an idiot for them up for a really cheap price when you see things like that. I mean, Lingard 3k, if we'd have got that, would have been a 6k profit, so that would have just summed up how good these players are, but I mean, you pretty much, if you be fast enough, you'll get them. It just depends how fast you are. But I'm not that fast at the moment, because I haven't traded for a long, long time. I just started back trading again recently, but yeah, we'll do a few more search on Lingard, then we'll move on to the next player here, so... Uh, there we go, we'll move on now to Kim Pembe, the PSG centre-back, who is here. He goes for, I think, around 12k, yeah, so he's actually gone up a little bit more, actually, now, which is mad. Then we'll have a cheap player at the end, guys, so don't worry, it was 12k yesterday, I'm sure. What is going on? Um, right, 14k seems to be the cheapest here, so yeah, 14k is the cheapest, so we're going to try and snipe them here for 12.5 to resell on for 14k so see if they do come up in like a minute or so that I'm going to search and then we'll move on to the final player I mean this one of course is if you have like my amount of coins or at least 60 70 k because you don't want to keep sniping you say if you only have 20k you can only snap one at a time it's not worth it whereas obviously if you have a lot more coins you'll be able to pick up a lot more of them just say it's a lot more worth than it with more coins so the ones if you have like 30 40k I'd say Adama Traore and Vincius Jr and then obviously Lingard can pen if you have a bit more coins. And the final one, guys, I'm going to show you in a second. It's for a lot less coins, so that's always helpful. Of course, there's always a nice little deal or so on them as well. It's not actually a player to snipe, though. That is the thing. I'll give you that. Um, it is not a player, but I had to put it in here because it is so, so good to do. So Kimpembe doesn't look to be um, very good today. And I think the servers have just broken on me. No, they haven't. Right, so the final, I'm going to do the final now before I get banned off the market. It is going to be the Hunter method, guys. I just showed this a little bit yesterday, but if you haven't seen yesterday's video, this method is sick. So if you're looking here, about 2k, something like that, 2.1k. If you put this up to around 2.4 here, you'll see that Jay Rodriguez is the only player up still. Probably about 2.8, there'll be one or two players. So, yeah, there's a few here, look. So, obviously, they're all average players. And so now what you want to do is, you want to just keep searching on the market, refreshing. Sniping, I mean, not sniping them as such, but going through each one. So now I'm going to drop this down to around 2.4. I'm going to move on to Shadow and just keep looking through for these players. This one's going to be quite a few up. I haven't put Defender in here. We had to put Defender in for this one, sorry. Um, so yeah, 2.4k Defender here. They seem to have dropped a bit. Yeah, they have dropped a little bit actually. So keep your eye on the price rate. So 1.9k here. We'll have a look. Um, there's not many up again, but like players obviously that come up and you see a good deal. The next thing you can do with this if you don't want to snipe and just go into like here 1.2k and start bidding on players when they come up as of when and then of course anchor and defender is the final one they go for about 1.5k 1.2k something like that here so yeah they all look for a k these ones here so what you can do here is snipe them at like 800 or even try bidding on them at like 800 here like you'll see there's a lot of players up you can find but there you go anyway thanks so much for watching if you have enjoyed this please do drop a like sub if you're new guys because we made 2k profit on one card they're just like that so that just proves it does work and i'll see you all next time in another video